Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It is basically December. Basic. Well, by the time this goes up, yeah. No, 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 no. Almost December. Almost December. Or maybe December. Who knows? We're keeping you on your toes. Yeah. Today, we're unboxing the Cherry Wallace. What is it called? Curation, Curation of, of Magical, magical Creatures. Curio Cron Curiosities. <laughs> <laughs> Look how cute this box is. It looks like Outpost. It's so cute and she did that on purpose. Cherry did such a good job with the first box that she had. Um, I did get that one as well, but Kayla was in Washington and it's all her fault. Yeah, that, that we you guys that didn't see. <laughs> um, I did try and go live, but we don't have enough subscribers yet. To go live, you need a thousand. So get us to a thousand, we can start doing live videos. Yes, that would um, be so fun when we can do that. Oh my god, I can't wait. We can all just hang out when we do our makeup yes. well, before a video, and then oh yeah, oh that'd be cute. That'd be really fun. Yeah. Subscribe if you haven't, please. Join the fan club. Yeah. We don't know what's in here yet. I haven't opened it. I just took it out of the packaging um, because it comes nicely wrapped, so nobody knows what it is at the Owl Post Office. It comes with the box. And it came with this thing. So there's two versions. There's the regular version that has seven items, I believe it is, and then the Maxima version, which has 11, and that's the one I got. It was around $70 USD. This is sponsored, no. We are, we are not sponsored. <laughs> not sponsored. This <laughs> was created by Geek Gear. They did a collaboration with Cherry Wallace. So Cherry, if by the very teeny tiny chance you're watching, watching this, I have binge watched every single one of your unboxing videos and I love you. Yep. So, hello. Hi. Okay, I just want to get it. Do, 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 do it, do it, do it. Okay, okay. I'm going to pop the top open, let you guys look first, and let us know if we need to open the tube first. Okay. okay. It looks... Oh! Ah! <gasps> <gasps> that is so cute. Oh, Cherry had to draw this. You think she did? Yes. It says, Happy Christmas, Neville. Oh my god. She wrote a little note. Okay, on the back. Dear friend, I couldn't risk sending Hedwig. Ever since the World Cup, the Ministry's been intercepting more and more owls, and she's too easily recognized. Sirius Black. May he I rest in him. peace. That reminds me, did you feed the owl upon arrival? It's quite cold this winter, and it's flown quite the journey to get to you. I can't believe the festive season has arrived. It's the most wonderful time of year, don't you think? This year has been filled with such magical... Nope. With such magic and our community is thriving. <laughs> our wizarding world has some of the most incredible, passionate, and kind-hearted wizards and witches within. And I'd like to say a huge thank you to all the support with the Curation of Magical Curi Curiosities this year. I wish you all a Merry Christmas and a very magical New Year. Always That cherry. is so sweet. She, I'm 150% sure she made this. She's an artist. True gem. That's so cute. That's going in my office. I would, yeah, I would for sure hang that up. Look at how freaking cute that is. Wow. So, I'll just put it down here. Oh, goodness. Okay, yeah, we're starting Whoa. with this. Yeah, let's start with this. <laughs> okay. okay. Oh my god. I can't wait. It's going to be some kind of poster or artwork. Yes. Okay, there's this guy named Muggle Magic DIY, and he does paper replicas, and he made an entire advanced potions book. Like, every page was filled out, and it looked like the real one. Uh, from the Half-Blood Prince and he doesn't sell it anymore and I'm wondering if it was for legal reasons but I don't know. Yeah, J.K. Rowling seems like she's really tight with the copyright that situation. Girl won't so even... I'm curious about like how they get away with some of these right? things. She won't even come out with a, um, a monopoly for Harry Potter. I know, like she can make so much money off that. Rude. Whatever. Oh my god. Oh. <gasps> I knew there was going to be a Yule Ball. Oh I my god. god. How oh my cute. God. So it's a poster for it. Here, I'll hold this. Okay. Yeah. It says, at the first wand stroke, lead your partner to the dance floor. At the second, Yule beverage will be served. At the third wand stroke, Yule feast will be served. At the fourth, witch and wizard of the ball will be announced. And at the fifth, wand stroke, Yule parade of wand skills. At the sixth, wand stroke, final Yule dance. Then good night to all our very special guests. Strictly dressed to impress. See Professor McGonagall for details. Oh my, this is definitely a Danny from Muggle Magic DIY. You think this you is, did that? The quality of this, absolutely. Yeah. And it's like soft touch. It is. Oh, it's like matte. Soft yes. touch. Oh my god, this is gorgeous. Wow. That artwork is really cool. It's beautiful. I, I can't wait that. to frame it. On to the next. Oh, Tiny the boxes or big boxes? Bo Let's do the big one. The big one? Yeah. Look how cute that's wrapped. Oh my god, I don't even want to It's like it. an actual Christmas present. That's I'm so going to try not cute. to look at the other things. Cover them. I'll open it in here. I need the suspense. Okay. Oh, 
I what? see like what? a pattern. Sorry. <laughs> I'm like is, looking this, through the wrapping paper. It better be Ravenclaw. Oh my god. If this is a Molly Weasley original. Oh, that's what I was thinking. Like a letter on it. Die. That is so cute. Oh, it's a scarf. Oh, oh cute. It's knitted. This is definitely from Molly Weasley. Whoa. Oh my god. Oh, hell yeah. It's like really good quality <clears throat> the colors are so like fall and i love 70s. this Very i like how 70s. it's not like house colors but i mean it's, it's a little bit of house colors but not like i wouldn't look at it and be like that's slither and yeah. a hufflepuff this is so cute molly this is a weasley original it is 100 percent. i'm wearing it right now that's so that can go with a lot too yes wow i'm surprised it's like really nice quality okay so how do the cool kids wear them now i don't know i, I always look weird in scarves i can never pull it off something like do you want to double it? I don't know. Am I supposed to? I think so. Okay. It's called fashion, Karen. Look it up. Respect the drip, Karen. It matches your eyeshadow, the green. Oh, oh that's cute. cute. My conscience, conscience, is that what it is? New. Okay, so just, I'm going to pull this out because I can already see it. It's a pin. Oh, I love, oh my God. I love pins so much. Oh my God, it has a dangly charm on it. <gasps> It's, it's like a Christmas wreath, right? Yeah. It's got gemstones on it. We'll do a little close-up. The Deathly Hallows. <gasps> it's so intricate. Oh, so detailed. Ball. Yes. It's um soft enamel or... Yeah. Soft. How can you tell the difference? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's either soft or hard enamel. We, we should pick. open this one. This one? Yeah. This has a little crown on it. What do you think this is? I think it's a chess, wizard's chess piece. You think so? Yeah. What do you think? Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. Is it? Is it? <laughs> <laughs> it is! Oh my god! Oh That's so my cool. god! Wow, so this is a true wizard's chess piece. It's red though. I didn't know they came in I colors. Yeah, I remember them being like black mm -hmm. or gray, but. Black, gray, and I don't know if this is the king or the queen. Teamwork. I'm a, I'm a guru, yeah. <laughs> Um, and it's very high quality. Quality. If I drop that, it will break. Ooh, it's, it's like heavier ceramic than I or something, right? Yeah, I can't tell. Oh my god, it's so pretty. That is really cool. So pretty. I love these little knickknacks. This says Owl Post, September, nineteen ninety one. Is that a hint? Are there hints on all these boxes? Oh, I know what this is. How do you know? Because you I read. No, I I follow this like unboxing Facebook group of like these boxes. And somebody posted her box. I didn't look at it. And I went to scroll past it. And it was like Cherry Wallace box items. And then it says pictures in the comments. And I just read the title of what the picture was. But I didn't see the picture. Oh no. Oh, this is it. Is it remember? This is what I thought it was. Oh no. Yeah. This is so cute. Oh my god. Ah! Guys. Aww. It's a freaking remember all. Oh no, that's my work phone. Oh no, pause. It's, it's so cute. It's not glass, thank God, because I'll break it. Is it plastic? Yeah. Isn't that adorable? Wow. I almost, how can I put red smoke in it? Yeah, that's wait, I was just going to say it's missing red. But Maybe how would I could you put like that? a light behind it and oh. just, like put, prop it up somewhere. It would be so cool if this was a um, ornament and it had like a red like Christmas light in it. Oh, cute. It's still really cool. Though. It is still really cool. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> Next. I love how even the worms are Christmas colored. Yes, they're brown, <laughs> red, and green. Yep. I'm curious what's in the bubble wrap. Yeah. Yeah, me too. It's the most ominous looking package. Is it another Yule ball? It thing? looks Yule ball themed. I bet you it's a bottle. You think so? I don't know. So cute. Yeah, it's got to be like. So oh, it's kind of heavy. Isn't it? Yeah. I, I think it's like a bottle, like a drinking bottle. Oh, or like a potion bottle. Yeah. Oh, it could be. Oh, oh, it's got a little pumpkin. Oh my God. Oh, that stopper is everything. Okay, so in the first box, we got a pin of three of these bottles that were different colored. Do you remember yeah. it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it's so cute. Now we have like a real one. It's like a holographic snowflake the sticker. Top. I love that pumpkin. It's so cute. What should I put in that? I don't know. You could do like some kind of like homemade potion, put it in there, like cute. a blue sparkly one. Even the bottom is blue, which is kind of cool. Yes. Frosted blue. I love that. I just want the pumpkin. Right? Thanks. Just give me the <laughs> oh my god, this is from Ron. Oh, oh. It's gonna be like chocolates. No, she wouldn't do edibles in her thing. I don't think so. Don't look at the other things. Oh, well, I'm gonna do this first. Okay. <gasps> the Ch Chudley Cannons. What is that? It's the one of the um, Quidditch teams. Oh! Like one of the like famous ones. 
Why didn't they give us one of the Irish ones? Yeah, the Hollywood Harpies. You yeah. bought that one? No. And I, is it the Hollywood Harpies? Did I say Hollywood? Yes. <laughs> Isn't it, um... Oh my god. My brain just took a huge shit on itself. <laughs> it starts with an H, right? I need to uh, look this um, up. Hollyhead Harpies. Oh, I was close. Hollywood. Hollywood Harpies. You've been in LA for too long. Oh my god. This is so cute. Oh, I love these. They have these, um, like the house banners at like Universal Studios, and they're like $25 they? per thing. Oh so they're expensive. God. And this is like really good quality. It's not yeah. cheap at all. That's oh cute. My god. And look, it has a place for like a stick. Oh. No! This one is the one I thought. Oh, are you sure? Yes. This is the packaging. It's super cute. All the packaging in the box yeah. is just so well done. Yeah. Very well thought out. That's for sure. It feels like Christmas. It really does. Is it something snitch related? Quidditch no. related? No. Oh, is it a key? Yes. <gasps> oh, this is my favorite thing so far. Oh. Oh my God, it's oh way no. better than I thought it was going to be. Oh my God. Oh, oh it's an ornament. My, yes. Oh my God. Oh, you guys remember the flying key scene? Oh my god, it's so, it the string is so long to make it look real. I don't know how to help you guys see the wings and stuff. Hopefully oh you can. Oh my goodness. They're like little um, see-through plastic wings. And you can take the string off if you don't want it. Oh. That's perfect. That's my favorite thing so it far. It has a freaking Deathly Hallows in it. I didn't even notice that. Oh my goodness. So cool. What are you going to do with that? Are you going to hang it up or put it on your tree? I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I want to hang it somewhere that it can stay permanently, not just for Christmas. Okay, so this is another paper replica of some kind, probably from Danny Muggle Magic, because he was supposed to have two in the box. Two? So you know it's about to be good. Ooh. Oh my it God. looks like an imitation, because there's two. Oh, ooh, I see a castle. I do see a little castle. Oh, I knew that was going to be in here. Oh my ah! God, that's so cool. Okay. I love that like gold metallic. Yes. Oh. It's so beautiful. And just in case you can't read it, it says the Yule. It just says the Yule, Yule Ball. Ball. Over and over and over. <laughs> over, and over. <laughs> the back. I think that's the front, right? Because that's where you oh, open yeah. it. Oh yeah. Okay. That's the front. That says Yule Ball and you open it. Oh my God. It's beautiful. I love the foiling. Wow. Oh my god. That's so, so intricate. Pretty. It says Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry together with the Ministry of Magic request the pleasure of your company at the Yule Ball to celebrate Christmas and the Triwizard Tournament. And then it has the Hogwarts Crest stamp and the Ministry of Magic stamp. It says to be held at 1900 hours, 7 o'clock, Christmas Day at the Great Hall Hogwarts School. That looks like almost they're trying to say four, four, four and older. plus. Yeah, yeah. four and older. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me that it's only like four and older. At twenty one thirty, which is nine thirty, hours the traditional champions waltz, strictly dressed to impress. Oh, oh my god, that's beautiful. That's so nice. This is something that I would just have up on my mantle like forever if I was fancy enough to have a mantle, but you know what I mean. Love. How does he make it? I How don't know. I I'm oh my god, and the envelope is pearlescent with gold oh. shimmer oh it's so faint you can barely beautiful. see beautiful last box cherry drew her own artwork and put it in here and i'm wondering if she did it again because it was beautiful she drew a mandrake last time oh i remember that that was really cute she did, oh, she did something else yes oh it's a howler it's so pretty i wonder what she uses is it like watercolor or i what? think it's watercolor that is so cute this is really nice paper. It is so pretty. It has the, Ron Weasley, how dare you? Whatever, whatever. Oh, Molly's quote in the background. Ronald Billius Weasley. <laughs> She's a really good artist. She's a really good artist. Oh my God, I love. love it. We have the cheat sheet here, but this is the very last thing in the box, Ron's present. I'm thinking that it's gonna be like one of the biggest things in the box. It has an H and an R on it and it says, Happy Christmas, Harry. Oh, I love Happy, Happy, Christmas, Happy Christmas, Ron. Oh, it's to both of them. Oh. Oh my God, if they're tiny knitted sweaters, I'm gonna die. Like the ornaments? Yes. Oh my God. Oh. Look at that packaging. So cute. It's so cute. Oh my goodness. I think you might be right. If, cause you can't have like Harry Potter Christmas without those sweaters. Is it? Let me see. It's not, it's not, but it's close. Ah! <laughs> this is even better. Ah, oh my god. my god. I would die for these. Oh my They're god. So cute. Come on. 
I'm putting them on. Right now, R for right. Oh. I wonder if she did that on purpose. H for left. H for <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, my sausage fingers. Get in there! I've never seen anything cuter than this. Oh my god. I would, like, I want to buy these somewhere. <laughs> Can you buy them separately or is it just like the whole box and that's it? I don't know. Somebody's gonna see me in public and be like, that's bad. That's I love so cute. I love your hand sweaters. I would pay like 20 bucks for these, honestly. So They're so freaking You wanna try them on? Yeah. I'm like pinching them <laughs> off your yes. fingers. Yes, I'm them. <laughs> oh my god, I can't Universal believe it. also has these sweaters, but they're like $90 each. I want one. I know, me too. <laughs> Worth it. Oh, so, so cute. cute. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is like the best Harry Potter thing I've ever seen in a box. <laughs> Got it. Perfect because I really wanted a sweater like this and I was hoping Sorry, they ask you how you are and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine <laughs> <laughs> But I was hoping for um, Like a sweater and I didn't think it would happen because they're so expensive and I know that yeah this Perfect alternative. Perfect. This is so much better than getting like a fake sweater that was just like t-shirt material. Yeah, that has, I yeah. would hated that. This is oh, perfect. What a perfect ending to that box. Ugh. You guys want to read about why she chose, what she chose. And... Yes. Okay, so this is Molly Weasley knitted scarf. I almost said sweater. Have you ever wanted to be a Weasley, designed to look like the ones given to Fred and George during Christmas dinner? I didn't notice that. I didn't notice that. Wait, I want to look it up. Grimmauld Place. Oh my god, I remember that. In Order of the Phoenix. Now you can feel like part of the family. Oh, cute. Oh my god, it does look like theirs. Oh my goodness, I'm a Weasley. I have the red hair down. That makes so much more sense now. Mm -hmm. At first I was like, this is not Harry Potter. It's still cute, but... It's still really cute, yeah. but now it makes all the sense in the world. That's so Oh adorable. my god, okay. Next is the flying key ornament. The flying keys from Harry Potter and the Philosopher's Stone are some of my favorite props. You can adorn your Christmas tree with your very own flying key. No broomsticks required to catch it. What would this time of year be without all of the festive decorations? Super cute. Mm -hmm. Love that. And then we have the wizard's chest piece. The moment I first discovered wizard's chest, I really wanted to play a game. This is a replica of one of the queen pieces. Oh, it's a queen. We see Harry and Ron playing with at Christmas in 1991. That's totally barbaric. That's wizard's That's chest. Yeah, did you read that or did you already know that? I already knew that. That's like <laughs> one of the best lines. And then howler artwork. Yes. The howler artwork. Ronald Weasley, how dare you steal that car? You Daniela. could have died! You could have been seen! <laughs> Wait, is that a different scene? I don't know. <laughs> I think that's when he comes back from stealing the flying car. Oh, Wait. Yeah. I don't know. I'm a fake fan. Roast me in the comments. Because remember he comes back home with Harry? Oh, it's when they rescue Harry. Oh, yes! Yeah, out yeah, of yeah. the, um, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. We're real fans. I really enjoyed painting my Mandrake artwork from my previous box. So I thought I'd do another one this time. I've always been incredibly fond of Howlers, though I'm sure Ron would disagree. Her artwork is beautiful. It's so nice. I can't, I'm gonna hang them next to each other. Oh yeah. Cherry, send me another, please. The next one is the Remember All. Don't worry if your Remember All hasn't turned red. It just indicates that you haven't forgotten anything. We can't all be as forgetful as Neville. This is a particularly useful magic artifact with some pretty remarkable powers and I wanted you to have one for when you enter a new year. Start off your year organized and make Hermione proud. Keep this item out of muggle hands and definitely keep it away from Draco Malfoy. And then we have Chudley Cannon's Quidditch team flag. Show your support for one of the best Quidditch teams out there. Well, according to Ron at least. This flag was designed to look like the one proudly displayed in the Gryffindor boys dormitory next to Ron's bed. What Quidditch team would you support? The Hollywood Hermes. <laughs> <laughs> Lady Gaga is the snitch. <laughs> Sounds wrong. <laughs> then we have the Yule Ball Invitation. Designed by Danny from Muggle Magic DIY, this stunning Yule Ball Invitation is one of my favorite paper replicas. It has been an amazing honor to have such a talented wizard's work inside this box, and I'm so excited to be able to share it with you all. Not only is there gold foiling, there's silver too. Nifflers are definitely going to want to steal this, so keep it safe. 
Do you have your dress robes or dresses ready? And then we had the Hogwarts wreath enamel pin. That was so freaking cute. Merlin's beard. This is another stunning hard enamel pin designed by one of my favorite witches. <laughs> Soft enamel. It's um soft enamel. You have a 50-50 chance you, you shot and you lost. It's okay. Amelia, wear your house pride this season with this pin that encompasses all Hogwarts houses within a beautiful festive wreath. Wait, does it have different... Oh my god, I didn't even notice. What? All the different jewels are the <gasps> colors the house of the houses. Colors. There's red, green, blue, and yellow. Cute. Aww. And then it says, oh, and Ginny dear, I'm awfully sorry, but my quill must have been cursed last time as I previously spelt Amelia's Instagram wrong. If you'd like to check out Amelia's magical work, you can find her at instagram.com slash Amelia underscore B83. We'll have that down below. And then Yule Ball Bottle. Did you see how luxurious the Yule Ball was in 1994? I don't know about you, but I certainly wanted to be there. Me too. That was part of the movies and the books where I was like, oh my god, I want to live that life so bad. <laughs> so jealous. She is obsessed with the Yule Ball. I am. When I told her about this box, she's like, so is the Yule Ball Christmas theme? <laughs> I was like, like Yule yeah. Ball? <laughs> then it says, around the towering ice sculpture, there were glass pumpkin juice bottles, and I've always thought how brilliant they'd look within a collection of Wizarding World items. Do you think you'd like pumpkin juice? I'm personally not so sure I'd like it. Maybe I need to make some to find out. I've had it from Universal and it's my favorite thing to get there. Oh, come on, you freaking anything, hater. Anything pumpkin. Have you tried it? No. I it don't tastes need like to apple know. cider. I don't need to know what it tastes like because I already know pumpkin tastes like both. It doesn't <laughs> taste like pumpkin. <laughs> the pumpkin fizz is so good. It's got like carbonation. Chef's kiss. And then it says Harry, okay, Harry and Ron Christmas gloves best thing. The knitted jumpers that Molly Weasley made for Harry and Ron are iconic. Unfortunately, I couldn't convince her to knit you all a jumper. She's already got her hands full having to look after all the Weasleys, but I hope these Molly inspired gloves will keep your hands warm this winter. I love Molly so much. She's one of the best characters. I want her to be my mom. I know. And then last but not least, the Yule Ball poster. Another magical treat that has been designed by Danny from Muggle Magic DIY. I loved the Yule Ball invitation so much that I couldn't resist including more of Danny's work. Add a little more festive mag magic Add a little more festive magical to your home this festive season. Oh my god. This so box was amazing. so good. Do you love everything? Everything. Yeah. Everything. Okay, your top two favorite items because both oh. of us love these. These, the gloves, mm -hmm. and I have to say the key. You like the key? Yeah. I have to say... Or the pin. I can't pick. The, I love pins so much. I'm a pin queen. I think this and the Yule Ball poster is my favorite. Yeah. There's there's too many things. There's too many things to love. How much was this? 80 bucks? Like 70. Yeah, like 70 bucks. That's such a good deal. Such a good deal. This alone at Universal, $50. Oh, yeah. Hands honestly. down, $50. Yeah. yeah. Perfect box. I want another. I want another right now and I want to have them once a month for the rest of my life. So that's it guys. Let us know if you want us to unbox any other Harry Potter mystery unboxings. There are plenty of them. I want to so bad. You guys have no idea how many yes. I want to sign up for. If you guys are subscribed to any, let us know what the good ones are. Like yes. all the Harry Potter subscription boxes because there's tons out now. There's even some that are like friends themed, guilt but there's girls anything themed. under the sun. Let us know. Give us all the titles down below and we can like make this a series. Mystery yeah. unboxings of yeah. different things. Thank you so much for watching and sitting with us while I unbox this. I have so much decor for my room now. I'm so excited. Woo! We'll be back. I don't know what our next video is going to be. but Yeah. Leave us comments what you want to see as always. And yeah. we'll see you guys in the next one. Yes. Bye. Bye. Happy Christmas. Happy Christmas, Ronald Billius Weasley. <laughs> is that his real male name? I think so. Oh.